what we do here is go back, 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 back. back. back to my channel or if you guys are new here hello I'm Keaton so today's video obviously as you guys could tell is going to be me recreating Bella Hadid's looks I picked just a few looks at first I was kind of trying to go overboard and like pack on like 10 to 12 and I really feel like instead I just went with quality over quantity these looks are some of my favorite looks I've like ever created. I really was so excited to film this. I asked you guys on my Instagram if you guys wanted me to start recreating different celebrity looks and I think I take a lot of inspiration in my day to day outfits and day to day life from Bella Hadid. I really love her looks and I think they're so much fun. Another thing I wanted to say about all of these outfits is while some of them, some of them are like really exact to what she's wearing, but I think it's really important to remember when recreating these outfits, taking inspiration, it's really taking inspiration from their outfits. So although that some of the pieces and some of the looks look very similar, it's always good to put your own twist on it. And I find that really important, especially if you guys are trying to discover your own style. You know, it's really hard to figure out what it is that you like, but if you guys go on Pinterest and you look up different celebrities and different looks and styles and you find those styles, you can always mimic those, but always try and tweak them to something that is more your aesthetic or your vibe and fits your personality better. A lot of her looks had different colors and different textures and things like that, and I have a very neutral wardrobe, so while some of the pieces are similar to hers, I really tried to mimic my personal wardrobe and my personal style and vibe into the outfits. I love these so much and I hope that you guys enjoy this lookbook and if you guys do don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Also if you guys have any other style guides that you guys want me to recreate, any other people that you guys want me to do, you guys can always comment them down below and I will try and recreate them for you. I was thinking about doing Emma Chamberlain just because I really love the way Emma Chamberlain styles her looks and I think that that would be a really fun one. So if you guys want me to do that, don't forget to leave them in the comments down below. Okay, I'm done talking. Thank you guys so much and let's get into it. So this is the first outfit that I'm recreating. I really wanted to choose a very simple but still stylish and cute look from her. So I really loved this one, especially because you guys know that I have been saying I'm really into baseball caps these days. So going off of outfit one, I chose to make the top cropped. Like I said, I kind of wanted to include more of my style in this. And then I'm pairing this baseball cap, which is just a nice nude color. Um, and I just wanted to make it more my vibe. So obviously I really loved the cargo pants that she had on in her original image. So the cargo pants I am wearing in this outfit are from Urban Outfitters. The hat is from Princess Polly. And then I just paired it with these Adidas Falcons. Very simple sneakers. She wore Converse, but I'm not a huge Converse fan. So again, making it more my style and including pieces that I really really love um, also you can see the top is from Brandy Melville and it was longer but like I said I really love crop tops and I thought that it really helped complete this look and I really really love this one for this second outfit I really just wanted to do this one because I thought that it was a very classy look and I've been really wanting to wear a little bit more midi dresses I think this is a really good look if you're going out at night um, kind of like she is here because I love the cardigan styled over this I thought this look was very chic and very different for something I normally would wear so the cardigan that I paired with this is from Brandy Melville I just love that it's buttoned up only at the top and then the dress which is like the staple like stunning piece is from the brand Riona and it's just this gorgeous brown color I really really love it and I love the square bag styled with this this one is from Princess Polly and I believe the glasses I'm wearing are also from Princess Polly. Um, everything will be linked down below and if it's not, I will have a similar piece linked to it. Um, and I really love the strappy sandals with this specifically. I think midi dresses, sometimes it's awkward, the length, um, and not knowing what shoes to wear, but I think that the strappy sandals really, really helped complete this look and I love this. I feel like a little housewife and I just felt so classy and cute in this. So for this third look, I posted this on my Instagram and you guys were dying over it and this is really something that I 
took this image and completely changed it to fit my style. So what I really took from this was I loved the tank top with the corset and the long trouser pants. So I took those pieces and made them more my style. So the tank top is from Urban Outfitters and the corset is from Princess Polly. These pants are just simple like tan trousers that I've had for a while. They're from Tiger Mist, but I really have had this corset and been struggling to style it. And I think that a lot of times I don't like to branch out with pieces, but that's why recreating these looks really helped me figure out how to style these pieces better. And so I really love the corset styled with the tank top. I probably would have never styled it if I wouldn't have seen that image, but I also really, really love the trousers with this. I will link some similar ones below because I know Tiger Mist doesn't sell these anymore, but I also paired the strappy sandals with this as well. And then something I really love was adding chunky jewelry. So I added this really nice choker that I thought was really pretty and chunky and nice. And I love the hoop earrings and the little claw clamp to pair with it. So this look I have seen all over and I have been obsessed with it for the longest and I really really love this all white look because I think that it's very casual and street style and I think a lot of times when people wear all white it tends to be like a more dressy moment so I love that she did this look doing all white but making it very very casual so I definitely made it with my style and my pieces so I am just wearing this plain zip up it's literally from Walmart like guys you guys always ask me where my zip ups are from go on walmart.com but I'm wearing this tank top and it is from Princess Polly I just thought it was very simple and cute I didn't have a corset style top like hers so I just paired it with that but the pants are what really makes this outfit I think having a really like cute flare leg white pant and styling it with the colorful sneakers is really what helps this look. Obviously, you don't need to have these exact sneakers or anything like that, but it's really just the concept of it. I loved keeping the claw clamp up in my hair, doing the hoops. I thought this look was so cute and fun and very much fits my everyday style. So for this last outfit, I loved the style of this, definitely took it and made it more my own, but I loved the button up with the folded down pants. I thought that was such a cute little idea, and so I really wanted to incorporate it again with my neutral palette. So you can see I definitely went with very neutral colors, but I'm wearing this little cropped button up from, uh, I believe it's from Revolve, and it's the brand Super Down. I paired it with my favorite little crop top. It is from Princess Polly. I love them styled together, and then I love the pants folded over. I think that it was something really simple that she just did randomly but it looked really cute um, and then I paired it with my favorite Adidas Falcons these are just super simple tennis shoes I talk about these all the time but if you guys need day-to-day -day tennis shoes they're the best and they look super good with pants like this um, the pants are also from Aritzia and then I really wanted to incorporate a different hairstyle I know she wears the claw camp a lot but she takes a lot of inspiration from 2000s and 90s so I wanted to put the little butterfly clips into my hair kind of make it a fun cute little look and I really loved this I felt like I branched out a little bit with my styling um, than I normally would so I really really loved this look that is it for today's video. I hope that you guys liked it. As I said, every single piece will be linked down below unless it's like not for sale anymore. I will also try and leave more than one piece. So if I show you guys a white tank top, I will try and leave multiple white tank tops. So you guys will have multiple sources to go to and buy different outfits from. Again, if you guys want me to see recreate anyone else's style, you guys can always comment that in the comments down below. Like I mentioned, I feel like Emma Chamberlain might be a really fun one to do, but also let me know. I'm not really sure. So thank you guys so so much for watching don't forget to subscribe and i will see you guys next time